this is a message for cancer for September 21st to the 27th. If you are a subscriber, I want to thank you for subscribing. If you are not a subscriber, hit that button and let's see. There's a few cards here. That, uh, one fell on the floor, excuse me. I want to thank you for subscribing, liking, and sharing. If you like a personal reading with me, uh, my information is down below. So Chariot, your own card is at the bottom of the deck, so you are moving forward here. With the Empress in its reversal, possibly you've been giving your energy away to others. You could have been creatively blocked, and this is telling you now it's the time for you to move forward. As you're moving forward, let's see what is it that you are releasing here. We have fortune's wheel. It is time for you to step into your destiny. So if there's been any karmic, it is now completed and you are letting go with gratitude gracefully. The 10 of air in the other decks, the 10 of swords has swords in the back, but here she's blowing the feathers. So this is with gratitude. It's gracefully, it's not in pain. It really understands the completion of a karmic cycle, something that has come to its end because you've gave away a lot of yourself to other people. It's now you are aligning with yourself, going in nature, taking a move forward, made a decision to now step into your chariot, into your own destiny. With the wisdom of the oracle, I'm going to see what cards. <laughs> a lot wants to talk to you, Cancer. So I'm just going to go ahead and take, here you go. A lot of cards that want to jump out. Okay. So we have not for you, so exactly. With the not for you, this card is talking about what was in the past is no longer here with the where you are headed. Now, Cancer, you're moving into your destiny. So what once was, you're now seeing where you put your energy, you're leaving it with gratitude, you're allowing the wheel to turn so you can move forward. Look at that, into what? Into a new life, into a whole new you. Where is it that you're moving into? You're moving into the connection with yourself, with source, with higher power. And the higher power is about tapping into your intuition, really allowing yourself to be guided. This is trusting in the universe, like I said, with grace and gratitude. With the Moonology card, we're just going to go ahead and take this card. It says, don't let your past hold you back. Exactly. And look at that. Look at the bigger picture. So no longer allowing the past, but you have learned what is not for you. So you can step and see things from a higher perspective. South note and full moon in Sagittarius. So this is telling you, yeah, don't look back. Move forward. Take the lessons you know now to spend time in nature and to allow the wheel to turn. And you know what is not for you is not for you. And open intuition. Seek clarification. This is really trusting in yourself. Trust in source, trusting in what you're seeing, trusting in your, in your own abilities, really understanding here your own magical power. What is it that you're here to do? 29 is 11. 11 is a master number. So what is it that you are mastering within yourself and really trusting your intuition in regards to what has ended so you can move forward? This is about what is going on with you now. The intuition is that inner voice of your soul cancer. So it's talking about opening up your intuitive channels, trusting the messages that you're receiving. And it can be challenging in the beginning, but really trust it. Always that knowing cancer. Just know that spirit is talking to you and it's time. Are you really listening? Are you listening to the voice of spirit right now about looking at things from a higher perspective and really observing without any judgment into what is being shown to you? So listen to your intuition about if some things want to come back with the wheel of fortune it's not for you it's time for you to step in with the chariot into your new life with source really channeling really you're coming into this new life and it's asking you again messenger of air you're receiving a lot of messages here don't forget here this is about love and light gratitude graceful spend time in nature and really allow yourself to listen to the intuitive nudges that spirit is giving you and to close you out the card that is flying. This one wants to come out too. Okay. So we have the card of elevation. Yeah. You're making the conscious decision to raise your vibration of love. So exactly cancer. If this has been something that has been, again, it's no longer for you because you're realizing that it is our energy where your energy is really matters and you know you can be in a low energy or high but i'm really seeing you stepping forward into you sending you so much love so much light namaste